Hello and welcome to Let's Play Final Fantasy VII. So we're on our way out of this goddamn, um, maker reactor, which I spent a good three minutes trying to fix or adjust the sound issues because some of it's very loud for reasons I can't seem to figure out why. The actual alarm noise or the bell that's going off is not part of music or sound effects, apparently. You alright? My leg got stuck. Let's get the fuck out of here. Thanks. Let's keep the planet going, at least a little longer. Yeah. Okay, now we're gonna get back. Get out of here. Rendezvous at Sector 8 Station. Split up and get on the train. Hey! It's about your money. Wait till we get back. Can't go back in there. Six twenty-five. The Loveless. Excuse me. What happened? I don't know, you better get out of here. Really? I don't know what's going on, but all right. I can't talk to those idiots. Who are you? What the hell's going on? Sounds like something blew up. Yeah, we found a potion. Hey, you there. Uh, 
Yeah, let's fight him. Fuck. I think he got an escape route. A lot of time to mess around with you guys. Enough babbling. Grab him. Cloud never came. Cloud, think he was killed? No way. Say, do you think Cloud's going to stand on and fight for Avalanche? How the hell would I know? Do I look like a mind reader? Y'all weren't such screw-ups. Hey, Barrett, what about our money? Uh, nothing. Sorry. Looks like I'm a little late. You're damn right you're late. Come waltzing in here making a big scene. It's no big scene. Just what I always do. Uh, I'm assuming that probably means fuck. Have it ever worried like that, you don't give a damn about knowing but yourself. Hmm. You were worried about me? What? That's coming straight out of your share, hotshot. Wake up. We're moving out. Follow me. Hey, Cloud. You were great back there. Well, we'll do even better next time. Careful. I'll shut this. Oh, Cloud. Your face is pitch black. There you go. Say, hey, thanks for helping me back there at the reactor. Anything back here? Oh, appears to be a no. Last train out of Sector 8 station. Last stop is Sector 7. Train graveyard expected time arrival is 12.23 a.m. New York Standard Time. I hate the last train. Oh boy. Oh, well, this is my house. Make yourselves home. See that headline in the Shinra Times? Terrorists that bomb the number one reactor are based somewhere in the slums. Blowing up a reactor. They sure put some thought into this one. They must have a real calculating leader. I wonder what they'll do next. Stop back like a damn kid. Sit down and shut up. Someday Avalanche is going to be famous. Me too. I don't know if you want to be famous for this shit. This train hasn't switched to security mode yet. I'm sure that will change by tomorrow. Wow, well, don't you think I got a bright future ahead of me? Well, what do you have in mind? All my life I felt like nothing but a sidekick. But after joining Avalanche and trying to save the planet, I feel like I can do lots of things. Well, good for you. Hey, Cloud, you want to look at this with me? It's a map of Midgar Rail System. Let's look at it together. I'll explain it to you. I like this kind of stuff. Bombs and monitors, you know? Flashy stuff. Right. Okay, it's about to start. This is a complete model of the city of Midgar. It's about one ten-thousandth scale. The top plate is about 550 meters above the ground. The 
The main pillar supports the plate at the center, and there are other support pillars built in each section. Whisper, whisper. The number one reactor we blew up was in the northern section. Then there's number two, number three, all the way up to number eight. Number eight provides Midgard with electricity. Each town used to have a name, but no one in Midgard remembers them. Instead of names, we refer to them by numbered sectors. That's how things turned out. Phew. Look what's up next. Look. This is the route the train is on. The route spirals around the main pillar. We should be coming around the center right now. Each checkpoint has ID sensor device, or has an ID sensor device. It checks the identities and backgrounds of each passenger on the train. And is linked up to the central data. Bank at Shinra headquarters. We definitely look suspicious, so we're using fake IDs. Speak of the devil. That line means that we're in the ID security check area. When the lights go off, you'll never know what kind of creeps will come out. We're almost back now. What a relief. Is that it? Please don't bother the other passengers. <laughs> oh, alright. So who am I talking to now? Look, you can see the surface now. The cities the city don't have no day or night. If the plate weren't there, we could see the sky. A floating city. Pretty unsettling scenery. Huh? Never expect to hear that out of someone like you. You're just full of surprises. The upper world. A city on a plate. It's because of that fucking pizza that people underneath are suffering. And the city below is full of polluted air. On top of that, the reactors keep draining up all the energy. And why doesn't everyone move on to the plate? Dunno. Probably because they ain't got no money. Or maybe. Because they love their land, no matter how polluted it gets. I know. No one lives in the slums because they want to. It's like this train. It can't run anywhere except where, to, or where its rails take it. Get over here, all y'all. Well, you've been a train man as long as I have. You see a lot of people and a lot of lives. People meeting, parting, joy, sadness. After a while, it doesn't even get to you anymore. This mission was a success, but don't get lazy now. The hard part's still to come. Don't y'all be scared of that explosion. Because the next one's going to be bigger than that. Meet back at the hideout. Move out. Anything over here? Oh. Uh, I don't know if I can do much here.
but nothing over here. I'm not letting you go tonight. Wow. Isn't there somewhere you, we could go to be alone? Wow. There's only the train graveyard around here, and they say there's ghosts around too. Damn. What? Save point. Is this guy taking a leak? Hey now. Whoops. What on earth are you doing? Just butt out. Jeez. Oh, well, you came to see it too? There was a bombing on top of this pillar. It should come down. If there was a bombing on top, if this pillar should come down, everyone in the slums is dust. Well, there's no point in worrying about that. Hey, check it out. It's huge, ain't it? Yeah, that's a big ass pillar. It's a huge fucking pillar. Hey, this is a strange and wonderful place. This is my place, but you can come here when you want. See you, bro. Alright, bro. Yo, Cloud, over here, now. What the fuck do you want, Garrett? Barrett. Uh, excuse me, you cannot pass without a proper clearance. Did I do this good? Did I do good this time? You gotta be tougher. But I, uh... Texas. Can't yeah, read the rest of that sign. Now we're done here. I'm not opening up. Go away. Okay, go on ahead. Papa. Say anything to Cloud? Marlene. Welcome home, Cloud. Looks like everything went well. Did you fight with Barrett? Uh not really. Hmm, you've grown up. When you were little you used to get into fights at the drop of a hat. Uh yeah, Chief sounds fine. I'm so glad everyone's safe. Oh, we can talk now. Uh, not like that first drink after a job. Hick. Why don't you have one too? Yeah, why not? Oh, that's more like it. Even if you were with Soldier, you're still a rookie here, so you better listen to whatever I tell you. Uh-huh. Oh, Clown. Tifa really knows how to cook. Hmm. Anyway, let me tell you about something. About what? Tifa always lets me taste her cooking. And look at me now. I'm roly-poly. Don't know whether I should be happy or sad, but it's the good food and drinks that make this shop famous. Alright. Hey Wedge, you're getting all excited. Stop making such a mess. Sorry Cloud, Marlene seems a little shy. Well, what the hell am I supposed to do? Papa, welcome home. Right, Bert? Great. Get in here, fools. We're starting the meeting. Sit down. How about something to drink? Give me something hard. Just a minute. I'll make one for you. I'm relieved you made it back safely. What's with you all of a sudden? That job even wasn't even tough. I guess not. You were in soldier. Make sure you get your pay from Barry. Don't worry. Once I get that money, I'm out of here. Cloud, are you feeling all right? Yeah, why? No reason. You just look a little tired, I guess. 
よ。Hey, look at the news. What a blast. You think it was all because of my bomb? But all I really did was just make it, like the computer told me. Oh no, I must have made a miscalculation somewhere. Oh, I mean, it seemed like it blew that shit up just fine. Wait,、right, do you think I'm a little too uptight? Nah, you're fine. Well, that's okay. Don't worry about me. I don't look like it, but I'm a coward at heart. Well, you made it through the mission just fine. Yo, Cloud, there's something I want to ask you. Was there anyone from Soldier fighting us today? None, I'm positive. You sound pretty sure. If there was anyone from Soldier, you wouldn't be standing here now. Don't go thinking you're so bad just because you wasn't Soldier. God damn it. Yeah, you're strong. Probably all them guys in Soldier are. But don't forget that you're skinny ass working for Avalanche now. Don't get no ideas about hanging out in Shinra. Staying with Shinra? You asked me a question, I answered it. That's all. I'm going upstairs. I want to talk about my money. Wait, Cloud. Tifa, let him go. Looks like he still misses the Shinra. Shut up. I don't care about neither Shinra or Soldier. Don't get me wrong. I don't care about Avalanche or the planet for that matter. Listen, Cloud, I'm asking you. Please join us. Sorry, Tifa. The planet is dying. Slowly but surely, it's dying. Someone has to do something. So let Barrett and his buddies do something about it. It's got nothing to do with me. So you're really leaving? You're just going to walk right out, ignoring your childhood friend? Uh. And these are like two extremes, like. Forgot the promise too. What promise? So you did forget. Remember, Cloud? It was seven years ago. Look, the well. Do you remember? Yeah, back then. I thought you would never come. I was getting a little cold. Sorry, I'm late. You said you wanted to talk to me about something. Come this spring, I'm leaving town for Midgar. All the boys are leaving town, but I'm different from them. I'm not just going to find a job. I want to join Soldier. I'm going to be the best there is, just like Sephiroth. Sephiroth, the great Sephiroth. Join Soldier. I probably won't be able to come back to this town for a while. Huh? If you make it, will you be in the newspapers? I'll try. Hey, let's make a promise. If you get really famous. I'm ever in a bind. You'll come save me. All right. What? If I'm ever in trouble, my hero will come and rescue me. 
I want to experience that at least once. Say what again? Come on, promise me. Alright, I promise. You remember now, don't you? Our promise. I'm not a hero, and I'm not famous, so I can't keep our promise. But you got your childhood dream, didn't you? You joined Soldier. So come on, you gotta keep your promise. The fuck, Barrett? Wait a sec, big time soldier. A promise is a promise, here. Received Barrett's stash, 1500 gil. This is my pay? Don't make me laugh. What? Then you'll... You got the next mission lined up, I'll do it for 3k. What? It's okay, it's okay. You're really hurting for help, right? That money's from Marlene's schooling. 2,000. Thanks, Cloud. Stick with me, and we'll have so much more gill than that. Alright. Anything around here? Oh, up we go. Nice. Good morning, Cloud. Did you sleep well? Next to you, who wouldn't? Um... Yeah, sure. I don't know what you mean. I'm going... I'm going this time. Good for you. Our target's a Sector 5 reactor. Head for the station first. I'll fill you in on the train. Yo, Cloud. Before the next mission, I got something I want to ask you. I, uh... I don't really know how to use material. I'll give you the material we found. Just teach me how to use it. You wouldn't understand. So this is what makes them guys and soldiers so great, huh? Okay, I'll ask Jesse again later. But you're in charge of the material. Yep, I'm familiar with that. Cloud, I got a message from the weapon shop man upstairs. He has something he wants to give you, don't forget. The clap. Marlene, you watch the store while we're gone. Alright, good luck. Child labor heard. Alright, where is a save point? I was say. Another slow day. If this keeps up, the store's going under. You can't sell any really good medicine in a slum like this. Oh, look at this. This doesn't happen every day. Are you, are you a customer? Yes, welcome. We sell, we buy. What the hell are you selling? Potion? Well, definitely one of those. Tried a bull geezer. We tried. We're tired. Why don't you rest up on the third floor of my house? There's just one condition. You gotta give me some cash. No. Cheap fuck. Hey, wait a minute. You, you can't just walk out of here without buying something. I'm gonna help you free if you know what I mean. What, the, what are you fucking selling? Iron bangles. Oh, we already got the assault gun. Grenades are really used heavily in the speed run. Let's get three of these. I'll buy five grenades. No, we're not. This is simply better. Okay, so. Lowers the strength by two, it increases magic by one. Get out of the way, kid! Alright, 
this is what I was looking for. So I'm gonna make the save here. Why is everyone looking at me? I'm gonna go ahead and make the cut here. As always, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.